The Inkata Freedom Party in the city of Johannesburg is calling for an urgent appointment of a new city manager. Now, this comes after the Gauteng High Court yesterday declared the appointment of Floyd Brink and the position of an, as unlawful, unconstitutional and invalid, furthermore ordering that his appointment be reversed. Speaking to Soweto TV News earlier today, IFP Johannesburg caucus leader Lungisi Mabaso says an urgent extraordinary meeting must be held to allow the city's council to carry out its duties and make a decisive resolution on this matter. City manager with city of Johannesburg. Um, since the challenges that the city has come, since the resignation of Dr. Lukwarin, Dr. Ogwenzega, we have seen that the recruitment process, um, what we have seen during the vetting process, we have the current Olobe city manager, man, um, Mr. Floyd Brink, what we have seen, he has a pending investigation. Um, no investigation, nigga was instituted by council um, because of the allegations as I think that he public safety and uh, he got implicated uh, along the way according uh, to the allegations. It must be the panel that recommends to, to the executive and the executive to council. So it happened just like that and we did advise them all, which you know but the process that they are engaging on um, in fact, by flouter because Abalandela am a proper procedures or would take Funeg recruit to city manager. So we were not surprised, in fact, by the outcomes of the court. Um, I mean, Umuto he cancelled the Chinese because um, it was expecting Uguti outcome in favor of a democratic alliance, which is unfortunate again now because now this thing has exacerbated instability in Konagu city and the administration now in instability. Man, we are sitting without a city manager, and, and, and I can tell you. Umeya is all responded in Jengoguchi Ati, he's still starting the judgment. There's nothing to start in that judgment. The judgment is clear and it's giving us a mandate to must go and appoint the acting city manager while we are sorting ourselves out as the city. And I think that's what we need to do. So the mayor must just, uh, you know, um, uh, he must just adhere uh, you know, and, and, and take the directive of the court and do exactly what the court is saying. And that's why we are calling on the speaker to call a council meeting, an urgent council meeting, because it's council that must appoint and it's council that must decide uh, the future of the city managers. Council does must decide whether to appeal the decision or not. I'm going to remember this is a council resolution. So a court, each council, a resolution, a council is invalid, unlawful, and also unconstitutional. So okay, a, a, a council is a military decision. If they want to appeal, they cannot do it outside council processes because that was a council resolution. But you get in a judgment, and the judgment is very clear, and we must just adhere to what the court is saying.